Oh, well, we don't know at the moment, but Pedro, William, uh, and uh, Giroud uh, are doing better. Yesterday we had the training uh, with the teammates, with the group. I don't know if uh, they will be able to to play tomorrow. Maybe not for 90 minutes. Uh, Loftus, uh, of course, is out now. Uh, we need to understand very well the the, the situation with the, his back. Because in the last uh, in the last month uh, he was in trouble. Sesk, uh, no, uh, I have no news about uh, about Sesk. He, I don't know if uh, he is able to play tomorrow because uh, in the last match, in the last ten minutes, uh, he had a, a cramp in the calf, and so. He was uh, a little bit. Uh, he needs uh, to 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 rest, I think. But uh, I don't know the situation. Uh, we have uh, to to see the today's training and uh, the training uh, tomorrow morning. There were reports that he's loaned to France. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Yesterday, he he had. Uh, a free day for the for the injury. I don't know. Are you hopeful of keeping him? Eh? But I I can say only my opinion. I don't know the the season of the of the club. Of course, uh, in my opinion, uh, he needs to go. You know very well the situation. You know very well that in this club uh, there is a rule. Uh, the renew for the players uh, over 30 is uh, for usually for one year. He has an offer for three years. And uh, I don't want uh, a, a very important player uh, as uh, Sesk uh, not happy. But uh, this is only my opinion. Um, then it depends on the club. How are you? Where did you go in the last uh, two weeks? You. <laughs> <laughs> Ah, Barella. Barella. No, I, I don't want to speak about uh, players of, of other teams, of, of course. Uh, if Sesk uh, will go, of course uh, we need uh, we need a replacement. Uh, but, uh, uh, now with the midfielders, we are in trouble, I think, because. Uh, I don't know at the moment the situation of uh, Loftus, uh, if uh, uh, the situation is uh, serious or not. Uh, without Sesk, uh, we are only in five, uh, so we are uh, we are in trouble. Uh, we need a replacement, of course. And Gary Cahill, he wasn't good in the, in the FA Cup squad at the weekend. Did you take no, no, at the moment, because I want to... to to understand uh, the situation, uh, if the, uh, he wants to 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 go or not, and so at the moment I think that uh, his mind uh, is not completely involved, but uh, in our situation, so we need uh, to to wait. But uh, for Kail, uh, the the situation I think is different because uh, we have Ampadu, and so we don't need uh, a replacement. I know only that uh, for me he's a very important player. Uh, he is very young, but uh, uh, now he is uh, improving. He's improving, especially in the defensive phase. I think he played uh, really very, very well in the last match. Uh, he was in trouble in, uh, in the match in uh, Watford, but uh, only because uh, we had. Uh, a problem uh, in his uh, hamstring, but uh, he is improving, and I'm really very happy with him. 
and uh, I don't know the situation with the with the club, but uh, for me, he's an important player. Would moving to Germany be a good career move? I don't think so. Why not? Because uh, he is an English player. He's a uh, very young. He has the future, and I think that uh, he has a very great future here in England with the national team, with the national team, and uh, with Chelsea. I think. I think that uh, to stay here is better for him. Okay. John? Have you spoken to him and, and said that to him? How important do you see him on the club? No, because I am not in charge of, of, of these questions and uh, I don't want to speak uh, to a player uh, about something that uh, it, it doesn't depend on me. Are you happy with that, though, that you, you don't have any say on what you say Yes, I want to, to speak to, to him uh, only about the pitch, about movements, uh, about the defensive phase. And I am really very happy because he is improving the defensive phase uh, uh, in a very important way in the, last, uh, in the last month. Is it important for you to see players come through the ranks and come through the academy and play in the first team? Or is that again not your responsibility? But first of all, I, I want good players, uh, but uh, we are lucky because uh, our academy is very, very good. And uh, I think it's important because uh, if you have uh, five, six uh, players from the academy, you can have uh, a soul uh, more than uh, with uh, 25 uh, foreign players. Oh, I think that uh, it's more important to score than uh, to celebrate. Uh, he scored uh, two goals in the last match. In the season, uh, he scored uh, nine goals. In your best, uh, in uh, his best uh, season uh, in Real Madrid, uh, he scored uh, 20 goals. So I think that uh, if uh, he will be able to to have. Uh, a very good second part of the season, uh, he will try to reach his best. He's happy though, is he here? I don't know. Uh, I hope so, but I don't know. Okay, Liam and then Martin. Mauricio, a couple of months ago you suggested that you didn't think Callum was ready to play in the Premier League necessarily, but with the improvement you've seen from him, are you ready to use him in? I think so. Uh, he is ready, I think. Uh, of course, uh, we have uh, uh, very important players in the same position. Uh, so, uh, you want William on, on the bench, I think. <laughs> no, <laughs> Pedro. Uh, I can play with only two wingers, I think. Three is difficult. <laughs> But uh, I think now he is ready. He is ready. He can play. Of course, sometime he will be on the bench. But uh, as uh, William, as Pedro, I think that now I can start to consider him uh, at the same level. OK, last two, Martin and then Matt. Uh, Mauricio, what lessons have you learned from the game against Tottenham in November at Wembley? That, uh, that uh, first of all, that uh, uh, we need uh, to to approach the match uh, in another way. I think because we lost the match in the first 15 minutes, so we need uh, to approach the match uh, in another way because they they were uh, really more aggressive than us, more determined than us, and so now we know very well that uh, if the approach is the same, uh, there is no solution for us. Uh, I want to speak uh, uh, before about uh, this because uh, otherwise it uh, is uh, really very useless to speak about tactics. Uh, we can speak about tactics only if uh, we are the same level of determination and application, otherwise it uh, is useless. Okay. We have to change also tactics, I think. 
Oh, but uh, they played uh, uh, with an offensive midfielders behind two strikers. And so, of course, uh, I think that in that match we needed uh, to, to play more uh, outside than uh, inside because the spaces uh, were outside. And uh, we, we, we understood uh, this uh, later in the match. OK, last question, Matt. Maurizio, there's been a lot of focus on the supporters with Tottenham and Chelsea recently. How important is it that everyone is on their best behaviour? I think that we need uh, this, uh, the support of uh, our friends, of course. But uh, we would like to 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 have uh, their support for us, not against uh, the opponents.